The all clear for coronavirus was given tonight at Miami University, at least for now. Two students who've been isolated all week tested negative for the virus. Brad Underwood is back from Oxford and joins us now in studio. And Brad, what's next for this? Well, good evening, Megan. Yeah, there are still some people on campus who visited China that have not been back in the country for 14 days. So that means they're still self monitoring. Health centers are ready to accept people who have questions about their health if they've been to China and they're ready to do all of this all over again if need be. But for right now, you talk about the all clear out of the woods, not given yet when it comes to the entire community, but certainly a big sigh of relief as both of those students tested negative for the virus. Now, after that, a big piece of advice uh, coming from doctors. Everyone uh, wash your hands, sanitize commonly touched items such as doorknobs and light switches. Now, with these cases being negative, there are still no confirmed cases of coronavirus or people being tested for the virus in the state of Ohio. Butler County Health Commissioner Jenny Baylor applauded the students for coming forward when they felt sick. I want to emphasize that these students did everything right to allow a rapid response to contain whatever virus was making them ill. They fully understood what was going on with coronavirus and they knew that they needed to report right away. They were responsible, conscientious, mature, and cooperative with every step of the investigation. Now the names of the two students who were tested have not and most likely will not be released. They are, however, cleared to return to normal student activities. Exactly what virus or illness they may have been suffering from that produced those uh, like symptoms that has not been released either.